All right, gonna give everybody an update on the solar boat here. Um, this is a 28-foot. It's a 1987 Tritune right now. Um, actually, gonna strip most of it apart now. What I want to do is quite a bit of a bigger project than what I've seen done before. So I'm kind of in uncharted waters. Give you a brief overview. Stripping off the uh, 88 horsepower engine on it and actually mounting on. It's a 11 and a half kW. Um, electric motor that's going to mount on top of where the engine actually used to be so this will all look the same and the lower unit and everything will actually be what's in the water it'll just have an electric motor on top of it instead of an engine that motor can surge up to 20,000 kW or I'm sorry 20,000 watts which is about 27 horsepower for 30 seconds um, it's a 72 volt electric motor so at that rated 11.5 uh, kW rate the 15 horsepower rate it's about 160 amps coming out of that battery bank so it's pretty substantial more than likely i'm going to be running this at about 5,000 watts about five horsepower um just you know tooling around the lake uh, we're putting a two and a quarter kw solar array on top of it it's uh six 360 watt bifacial solar panels i'm building a custom racking that's going to cover the first 20 feet of the boat it's actually going to be a solar canopy uh so basically what that means is we've got a rip all of this stuff off and redo from the ground up. Um, that solar array with the canopy is going to be about 400 pounds, so I've got to custom build everything there. Um, I want to get rid of a lot of the, the facia and the siding with it so that it doesn't catch the wind as bad. Um, lots of little projects. I'm going to you know, redo all the tunes and, and get them shiny bright again. We're actually going to ditch the carpet on the floor because this is the beauty of this boat is it's supposed to stay outside in the weather. So we want to build everything on it, sunproof and weatherproof as possible. But you could go out and actually um, plug it into a barn or something and, and power a barn. So it's a mobile power source as well as a solar electric pontoon boat. So I'll keep you guys up to date on the progress.